was talking about how blogging is such an awesome tool because it's something that you can you can like watch your grandkids one day can watch you like the process of how you live, you know. So I thought it'd be cool. I leave something for my grandkids if ever. And then coming up after that, we've got the open mic, which is the main attraction that I know many of you are here for this evening. And so, with no further ado, can I get the band on stage? Ladies and gentlemen, clap your hands. This is JP Romello. Sorry. Wanna go get some caffeine? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You know, I'm just letting the people know on Instagram what's good, what's going down tonight. Oh, what's going down tonight? We just wanna hit the stage. Hey, what's up? How y'all doing? My cringe compilation, cringe nation. <laughs> How y'all doing? Uh, what's up, mom? Jeff, tell us about Jordan. Them. Oh, Lord. <laughs> Cringe Nation, <laughs> how are y'all doing? I love you. I love all y'all videos that make me cringe. Just another day in the life, you know? Jeff, just talking about how life is good. Just Cringe. I love you, cringe. <laughs> this guy's cringe level is so high. It'll make you cringe, cringe. You, you do cringe to me. I love you. I love you. Uh, bong pops. So far, I only got four. Well, five if you count. Little Star Lord. But it's growing. Each Funk Pop has a story. Now, these two were my first two Funk Pops. I had an Iron Man Funk Pop, but I gave it to Benny. Yo, shout out to my boy Benny. He gave me my first laptop. <laughs> and that's where I started making beats. And then I bought this one. It's my baby now. Gary <laughs> me. Gary me. Oh, <laughs> Saying this is George, the cameraman. Mm -hmm. 
Yep. He's gonna be following me around today. Good job. Vlogging, documenting. Yeah, so the whole idea behind doing this is pretty much, you know, to document, to to document not just for you. I mean, we live in a in an era where people don't watch TV anymore. People are only watching online content, so I thought it'd be a good idea to vlog, I guess, and document. And also, I went to Tampa a few months ago and to this event. I went to see Gary V. He was talking about how vlogging is such an awesome tool. It's something that you can, you can like watch. Your grandkids one day can watch you, like the process, the how you live. You know, so like my goal is to become a music producer one day. His goal is to become a movie director one day. I mean, I would have loved to see a whole movie about my favorite artists and producers before they made it. They would have documented. It. So, yeah, so that's why we're doing this. Hey, hold up. He's beeping. What? Oh. <laughs> Traffic. Traffic. Well, shout out to Georgina. Hey, Start why don't you vlogging. vlog a little more? Huh? <laughs> Start vlogging. Wait, wait, you gotta, you gotta record. Oh, man. Ramen noodles. <laughs> That's what that guy likes. <laughs> My name is George. George Gonzalez. I'm a uh, student at First Institute, just like Jeff here is. Uh, started out small back, back in the little town of Lake Placid with uh, my brother making videos and stuff like that back way back in 2013. Now we're here, it's been a process, but um, it's, it's come a long way. And, uh, I hope one day to aspire to be one of the best you know, movie directors in the industry. Hopefully inspire other people to make, make it big and never have to follow what you know, society deems it worth. I'm also a short film director amateur editor and also a, a amateur special effects supervisor. Recently I've just directed my first commercial. It's a pretty good process, it's pretty fun. I hope one day that it all pays off because that's why I'm here. I moved here in Squirrel. Uh, we live in a world, I believe, in my opinion now, uh, that a lot of people like to do a lot of things everybody else is doing. And it's, it's, it's stressful to get your stuff out there and get a lot of people to look at you because you don't want to be like everybody else. So. Facts. I told you. Thing, maybe not. I don't know. Uh, shout out to Georgina. Hey, start vlogging. 
And Gary B, thank you for inspiring me. And I don't want to miss out. I want to catch the process. I want to film the process of maybe one day if I make it, I can watch. I can sit back and watch. And it's all about the process. It's all about the journey and the good times, the hard times. And you know, the end result, once you get there, you get there. But you got to have fun in the process to get there. Yeah. <clears throat> uh, Jeff L underscore seven. All right, turn up. Yeah. What's up? What's up, man? <laughs>
we have back there running the show and uh, on keys, we have Jeff Leva. So you guys can get out the And then we have on drums and drum pad Nick. Uh, you guys get and uh, we're all, uh, all of us, even though you might not have experience so tonight, uh, we're all of, all of us are Audio One. Audio One, and, uh, Audio One is stu uh, students, so we're pretty much dealing with all of this ourselves, and uh, it's actually uh, a lot to put up with. And uh, all of us are actually in school, in the same school, so I want to give a huge shout out to uh, Spanos and Erica for coming out, and and uh, Chloe and all of the guys from Daytona State, and uh, these other two guys, Rashawn and uh, Jeff Cozy First Institute. So thank you guys for coming out too as well, and uh, I appreciate it. Give them, give them a round. Of applause. Can oh. oh. we just run that track again? Uh, I think that my vocal needs to go up. That's what I'm being Way told. Up. Yes. Way I didn't have it in the shot, but um... <laughs> harmless terrorist. The harmless terrorist. <laughs> He's going with it. Harmless terrorist. Yep. I'm the harmless terrorist until the harmless tears apart. And you know that I want to put some hummus there on my ribs just in case the crackers wear off. 
Yeah. No. Nah. Cringe. Nation. <laughs> that was so much cringe. Please delete that in the future. No, keep that. Just don't keep it. If you do keep it, don't fat to it. You said don't fat to it? I'm just... So. As in fapping? <laughs> Alright, so, what was the question? How'd it go, mother? Oh. That's the real one. <laughs> well, it was a vlog. Listen to me, vlog. It was a cool experience. Um, it's the first time I'm doing a live show with people. Um, I was sweating, I was nervous the whole time. A few, a few mistakes, a few oopsies along the way, but <coughs> oof, a few mistakes, but but it was good. It was a good experience. That was fun. Again, I was really nervous. The mistake is leaving that pimple in your face, man. I'm gonna pop that. Oh, come on, bro. So yeah, yeah. But it was good. It was good. Thank you, man. Thank you for doing this with me, man. Thank you for vlogging with me. Vlogging. I want to inspire people to vlog, Georgina. Vlog. Yeah, G. <laughs> Log. Log. I don't always do this. <laughs> <laughs> but if I George do, is vlogging. But if I do, but if I do, I do some Heineken. And I'm sorry to say that. <laughs> I used to drink Amber. But that's Are you okay, man? <laughs> <laughs> I'm, trying to be, I'm trying to be serious right now, bro. <laughs> Oh god. I can't handle Look at that thing. Thomas Terrace. <laughs> Yo, my cringe people, my cringe nation, my cringe geeks. We here. We here. We live. We Gary live. Oh, yeah. Gary <laughs> should've done it tomorrow. <laughs> We're running. <laughs> so peace out. Peace. Peace out, Girl Scout. What kind of forever? Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna cut that. Gonna oh, cut come that. on, man. Your mama forever. Uh, I'm gonna keep that one. <laughs> <laughs> hey, now, let me do another one. Let me do another Please one. don't. Do it. Thank you. Not <laughs> to make this go viral. What kind of forever? Oh, God. Oh, man. You felt I that? like that cringe. <laughs> <laughs> I am proud. Thank you. I learned from you. <laughs> no. You yeah, no. Nice little humper you got there. <laughs> oh my gosh. Look at that. Look at that nose, boy. Dude, that spoke to my soul. thing I want to I want to talk about is um just perspective like during the show we we messed up when during the beginning you guys didn't get to see this but as soon as the first song started playing we ran into some issues with the, the sound and feedback and gain you know I was I was freaking out and but the point is um you know I guess the show went great afterwards, but it's just how you look at it, you know? It's all about perspective, and even one of our friends in the group that was with us, he he got on stage afterwards during the open mic, and he talked about it, you know, just perspective, and how we are going to remember the show depends on our perspective, you know? I think it was a good show. We messed up a little bit, but it was a good show. It's not just about the show, but just perspective in general. You know, how's your you know perspective in life? 
you know, this year hasn't been the easiest year. 2018 sucked. Has been not the best year so far, but you know, I'm just trying to um, I'm just trying to keep a positive perspective and um, if you can take away anything from watching this video is just remember to keep a good perspective in life and yeah. Thank you for watching.